Hey guys, what's up? John here from Techspecs. In this video, I'm showing you guys how to enable iMessage on your Hackintosh. So you guys want to open up the links in the description. Um, thanks to Bob Roach and the guys at Tony Mac for helping me out with this. So once that's done, we want to open Clover and click continue, continue, install, and then struggle with my pinky to type in my password as I'm holding the camera without a tripod. Um, I just want to say I'm sorry for the crappy camera job and whatnot. Anyway, so it only takes a couple of seconds, and now once it is done, we can go ahead and close that. And now we need to open one of the links in the description. The other one, select it all and copy. After we've done that, we can close this um, iMessage fix thing, and then go up to the search bar and type in EFI. Once that's done, we want to go to the config.plist, open with, and then open with other, and then find text edit. So we want to scroll down to text edit and make sure it is completely selected. So go ahead and click on it one more time just to be sure that it is selected. Once that's done, I'll get you guys a closer look at the screen. Um, it's going to look a little bit like this and we want to change it. So this is the standard Chameleon bootloader. And we're just going to go paste in between those two gaps. And as you can see, it needs our serial number. So what we're going to do is up to the Apple logo, go to About This Mac. And as we can see, under OS X, we can double click that and it will give us our serial number. However, I do not like that way because you can't select it all. So you can go more info and the serial number is there. And this way you are able to copy it. So we're going to copy the serial number. And then once that's copied, we can close about this Mac Pro. And now we're just going to paste it where it says serial number here. We're going to highlight it and paste over it so it is no longer there. And then we're going to add in, I think it's six digits. So it comes with tell... Uh, just make sure it equals up to 17 digits so you can just type in any random crap in the box. Make sure it's capitals or it won't work. And once that's done, you can go back to about this Mac. And then we can go more info and system report. See, we need to do this because we need to get the Mac address. So system report, and then we, that means we need to go down to network, I think. So we're going to go down to network. And if you guys have wireless, then I'm sure it will be wireless for you. But I'm using Ethernet. Um, because it's a lot stronger and reliable for me. So you want to copy the MAC address. Um, nothing extra to add, just copy it. And we can finally close about this MAC Pro for the last time in this iMessage fix. So, back to this, where it says MAC address here, we're just going to select it all and paste over it again. And then once you've done that, guys, you want to make sure you have saved it and close everything open on your Hackintosh. So, the installation is really simple, as you guys can see. Good job if you're following along. Uh, again, big thanks to Bob Roach for helping me out with this. Uh, there's another guy on YouTube that also did it via USB or via um, whatever. Um, and big shout out to the guys at Tony Max for making this possible. They did work hard and I knew they'd fix it. Our community is awesome. Anyway, so once that's done, guys, sorry the camera keeps um, focusing itself, if that's the word. Anyway, so you just want to reboot your computer. And this, since this does change the bootloader, it's going to look a little something like this. So I'll interrupt the camera and I'll just go in and click enter for you guys. And now it's going to look something like this and it might freeze and stuff and some might say error and unable to boot and all this crap. Don't worry about it. This is just behind the scenes of the Apple logo so everything's the same. Anyway, now back to the, um, the password screen so I'll struggle to type in my password with my pinky again. Open iMessages and I'll give you guys a quick demo with my iPod Touch. So I'll say hey to myself because I'm just that popular. And then as you can see, it comes up on the screen. And I can also message back and everything functions how it should. So thanks guys for watching. Please don't forget to hit the like button. Feel free to comment below or message me. Thank you.